nine, they have given it to you. But one thing you understand is that Ikbobola Marizu Akazo dear. Are you okay now? Very well, thank you. Okay. I will see you soon tomorrow. No. I have a very serious engagement in school tomorrow, so I will be very busy. Okay. <laughs> so, um, I mean, when do I get to finally meet this? Um, your sister being the one you've been talking about. Hmm. I cannot take you to my sister. She's going to kill me. <laughs> <laughs> Why? Because she doesn't want me to have any relationship in school. Hello. She wants me to face my study. Hello. <laughs> but I'm serious. Look, I am very serious, okay? Never can tell this might eventually end up in marriage. Until then, <laughs> okay. I I would want to leave. It's getting late. All right. No problem then. Just um, drink up. Finish up your drink. I'll drop you off. Okay. Frank, I need you to tell me something. What is the sign? It's not in my place to tell us, Chico's here. You should probably talk to our parents about us. <laughs> you and I know that Pius will never tell me anything. So are you telling me or not? Look, she goes here. This isn't easy as you think, okay? I am not supposed to say this. So let's not talk about this again, please. Say it already. She goes, I have not say it already. I have nothing to say, okay? Let's just not talk about this again. Please. Out of your mind. How could you have done that? I'm so, so sorry, Rikia. Okay? I didn't know when I said it. Rita, said what? Francis told uh, Chiagose about the sign. What? Francis did what? Look, that's not possible. Like, why? No one is supposed to leak that secret except our Lord Spiritual. Why would you do a thing like that? So what's going to happen now? Guys, I'm sorry, okay? I'm so confused right now. You know, you know what? Um, I have to talk to a lot spiritual. Okay? Peter, I'll call you. Okay. Alright? Thank you, Francis.
Chigos, eh? I, I don't know. But what do you want me to tell you? Kifi Chokangwake. I don't know. In fact, Answer me! In fact, yes, yes, that's the sign. Chigos, eh? that's the sign. So the family killed my mother. No, you killed your mother, Chigos. Eh? You missed a conversation with the Lord Spiritual when he asked to take your stepmother or your mother. You never answered. So he took his decision. So he killed my mother instead of my stepmother. Huh? The law spiritual makes decision that befits the family. And how is my mother's death going to benefit the family? The law spiritual weighed your heart and found out that you hated your mother for all she did to you. Rather, your heart felt for your stepmother. So she had to go. You mean... She knew all this. Are you never care to tell me? And what should I have done? Hmm? No, tell me, what should I have done? Okay, I would have called you. Check us here. The Lordship is about to kill your mother. Rush now. Go and save your... Oh, really? Are you for real? I have to know it. I have to know it. Yeah, bro, class, I know. That was first step. back. We check in the queer. Sorry, please help me with that towel.
you may present your monthly offer. Surely, your time of being grounded is over. Onyechi. My lord. For breaking the code, your offering is multiplied by 10. Doze. My lord. The special offering is required tomorrow's night. I hope this is clear. Yes, my lord. Sit down. You know we got the money. You know we got the dough. Take a look at the base. You see we making sense. Who is that mother? Go give him financial pay. I don't need the goggle map. My laptop will show me the way. Look around and tell me what you see. Bands. Bands. That's why they call us the Bains Man. It's a fireball, fireball, it's a fireball. School has been treating you very well. Mm, sister, school has been so stressful. Stressful? I'm not seeing any stress on you. <laughs> I mean, with your bones stretch, you don't look stressed. Uh, at least you wouldn't insult my head. Yeah. <laughs> it's no longer sponge. You are doing well. You are doing well. I'm upgraded. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, hello, Francis. Please, where are you? I, I am coming right away. Okay. Yes, yes, I am coming right away. Look, Francis, this is someone I want to get married to. I mean, this is someone I'm planning to spend the rest of my life with. I wish I could reverse it. <laughs> reverse it? You and I know those things are irreversible. Francis, I love this girl so much. 
Yes, of course you love her, but man, you just have to let go. Okay, you just have to let go. Um, you said you wanted to discuss something with me. And, um, you've been so excited about it. What is it? Sister, mm -hmm. I've seen someone. <coughs> Sorry. You're doing what? You are seeing someone. Amara, you of all people. Uh, yes, sister. Sister, I know we had an agreement. Of course we did. Uh, but things changed. I know. <laughs> you must really love this guy. Yes, I do. It's quite obvious. I mean, it's written all over you. <laughs> and um, he wants to meet you. Really? So why don't you bring him over to the house? We could sit together, have some chit chat, and then have some time. You'll know, get to know him. Ah, star. Yes. Thank you. <laughs> I'm gonna break the news to him. He'll be so excited. You're welcome. Thank you so much. So can you now eat and stop blushing? <laughs> nice food. You're welcome. welcome. <laughs> Enjoy yourself. He know it is against the law for a grandmaster to wait before his subject after a procession. I have been overstressing my immunity. The rest of the family have presented their offering and they are all gone home. But they are still hung in here, finding it difficult to do that which is needful. I'm giving you 30 seconds to do so. Zodiac! Fifteen. Twelve. Five. my presence. Doze, you've been moody all day. What is going on? My guy, get for the now. I love this girl. I love this girl. Yeah, but she's dead. She's dead and gone. Life goes on. It's right. It's right. Remember what you told me when my mom had to be the sacrificial lamb? You said to let it go. So please let it go. Hmm? It's okay. We are planning on getting back. We are dwelling on getting married. But she still would have died someday. Exactly. Eh? You know this thing, eh, Makwa? As you know, she's dead. Dead and gone. And gone. Life goes on. Chop money. Chop money. Enjoy your life. 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 Hey, 
Jesse's eye. Amara. Amara. Amarachi. Amarachi. Amara. No! Amara. Amara. No! No! Yeah, hold on, who is that? My sister is dead. What? How? My sister is dead. How? When? I just came back today and I found my sister dead. Who must have done this? What do you mean by who must have done this? There is no other person who would have done this apart from Chiagosi. No, 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 no. That bastard had the guts to kill my sister. Oh, yeah. Please. Chiagosi is my friend. Likewise, you, okay? You cannot jump into conclusion. How did you know that? I am not jumping into conclusion. He is the only person on earth who wants to take something that belongs to me. From me, it is Chiagosi, and I am sure. I am telling you that he killed my sister. I came back to the house and I saw my sister dead with him. With her mouth wide open, she died with a sign. What? So tell me, why wouldn't I point at Chagozi? Died with, with the sign? That means one of us did this. Oye, listen. We have to get to the root of this. We have to find out who did this. I already know who did it and I am going to snuff life out of him. I am going to take away every single thing that makes him happy. I will make his life so miserable. That is a promise. Did you consult with the eye? What does the eye have to do with this? Because you're so fast in concluding that I not, did it. I am not concluding. He did it. I swear he did it. I am very sure. We must get to the root of this. This is not a matter of whether he did it or he didn't. He did it. What's happening? Does it please say something, okay? Does at least please say something? Sugar's only sister was found dead this morning. What? What happened to her? No one knows. She said she met her dead with the sign this morning. The sign? The sign. Our lost spiritual doesn't make sacrifices. We do. Yes. What exactly are you insinuating? This is certainly the handiwork of one of us. He's certainly right. <sighs> Guys, one of us killed Sugar's sister. You know she's actually suspecting someone. Chia Gozi. This is true. But why, why is he doing all this to his own sister? By the way, what is he? Does he have heard about Sugar Sister's death this morning? Yeah, I heard of it too. I, I mean, it's terrible. It's terrible. Boss, the sugar is at the gate. She creates for your presence. Well, I will join her soon. Thank you, boss. What is sugar doing in your house? Are you asking me? Why don't you go and know why she's here? Do you know what? I accept his challenge and the battle I have to join. What the What are you even saying? I... 
I'm, I'm listening. Listen to you. You know what, Rita? We can't continue like this. You know what? We need to talk. You need to step out. Just tell me where to come and meet you and that's it. Fine, I'll meet you up. Forgive me. Forgive me for keeping you waiting. I'm so sorry. You always keep people waiting, so I'm used to it. Oh my god. Did you really have to say that now? Come on. I've been waiting for you for almost two hours. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. A friend of mine actually lost her sister. That was why it took so long. Forgive me. What happened? Ah, I don't know. She died. Just like that? Just like that. That's quite a pity. Anyway, uh, what do I get for you? Um, what? What's that? <laughs> Waiter! What <laughs> Waiter! It's your house. Hey! Hey! <laughs> Brother, this house is fine. This house is beautiful! You haven't seen anything yet till I take you to my mansion in the heart of the city. Then you marvel. Wait, wait, wait. You still have another one in the city? Yeah. Hey! Oh, <laughs> There's a saying that good people doesn't last. When I heard of her death, I I changed my mind and I begin to believe in that saying. Brother, you need to see Nedi. That woman was crying. She cried out her eyes. I really feel for her. Wait, oh. Is that why Onye took her from the village? I think so. But well, I've been thinking. Thinking about what? Well, our family is gradually getting slim. I think it's high time we call for peace. Because it's peace that binds family together. Mm. Eh? What that you and I know is disintegrated. Even right from the village, you know I never looked for their trouble. They are the one who see us as enemies. I tried to stay away from her and her mother. I want you to be quiet! Quiet! The essence of a family that born is proven in times of trouble. I perceive already that your heart is heavenly laden. I am already seeing that so many of you here have landed yourself into too much trouble than envisaged. Instruction from the beginning has always been to move about and be in communion with your gadget as the eyes to the world. Your heart 
is not only heavy, your heart is heavenly ladder. Onyinye, your heart smells wickedness and vengeance. Dozier, don't forget that as twisting the nose produces blood. Chigoze, you have to be more careful than ever. Where is Harris and Max? A lot has happened lately. We are killing us. We are supposed to be fighting for us. But the reverse is the case. And it has to stop. What's going on, brother? One of us killed someone very close to my heart. Someone very close to my heart. And where are the others? They are supposed to be here. Yes. Then we have to wait for them to be here. Can I confide in you? Of course. I want you to kill Chakosi. What? Are you mad? I'm not. No, you are. I am not. I only want a basic human being dead. Is it that you are in or you're out? You want me to kill Chigose for you? Of course. But well, you and I know that's very impossible. How? You know no family member can actually kill on the Oh, fact. please. All you need to do is to break the sixth one. You know, I cannot actually kill him. Of course, you know I would have done it myself. We are family members. I mean, we are family. We are binding together. We, I can't kill him. So I am asking you to kill him for me. That's all. That's all. That's all. Is that simple? Sugar. What? You want me to sleep with Chigose? Is that what you're telling me? So, what's that means like a cockroach sleeping with a millipede? What's that? Sugar. You are so arrogant. You're so full of yourself. Oh, please. Wait, 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 hold on. Is that why you called me out? Yes, Tell me this nonsense. Of course. I mean, aren't you too great for seeing me? Sorry, I, I have no idea of what you're talking about. What are you saying? So 
tell you what I'm fucking doing. Get you. <laughs> What is this? Rita, what happened to you? Sugar did this to me. Sugar did, Sugar did this to you? Why? Sugar killed Dennis. My own Dennis. She confessed to you? I saw it through the eye. Why? Wasn't she aware that Dennis was your man? I mean, Dennis was your fiancé? Of course. Of course she was aware. I even told her about him. I went as far as sharing his pictures to Sugar. But she still... She killed him. What? Why? What is wrong with this woman? Why? What would she offer him? What is wrong with this? I mean, I don't understand. Why is this woman so wicked? She did it to get to me. Sugar asked me to break the Sith law. To sleep with Chigose. When I refused, she then went after my man. And used him for a monthly offering. Yeah. <laughs> this is wickedness. I mean, this is total unacceptable. This is cruelty. <sighs> so what are you going to do now? I mean, what are we going to do? Papa used to tell me how his father persuaded him to get a second wife. Just because Nelly couldn't bear him male children. Then he also said that the family has been in peace until Mama gave birth to me, then you. Then Mama started making troubles with everyone around just because he had male children and also started dragging the things Papa had on ground with everyone. But where is she today? She's gone. Look at Neddy. Ned is still alive. Because she's a woman of peace. But Mama, Mama always wants war. She's dead today. War is the only thing that can pull your enemies down. And war is the only thing that can also pull you down. Brother, um, why are you telling me all of this? We're in need of peace, but war surrounds us. Brother, I think we should see Winya and her mother. I'm happy that they are living in the city now. We need to see them. You are the only family I have now. And I cannot afford to lose you or allow you to lose your life. So, stay away from those people for now. Ask me why. Just stay away. Oh, what are you doing? 
in my house. How, how did you get in? With, with the gun? You killed Dennis. And you really thought you were going to get away with it. You lied to yourself. What is wrong with you? No, what is your problem? Yes, I killed Dennis. What do you want to do about it? Kill me? Oh, come off it. You know that that toy you're holding right there cannot even kill me. Because you cannot kill a member of the family. So what the hell are you doing in my house? You really thought I came here to play, right? Oh, please, just... Brother, I'm ready to go. Uh-huh, like I've sent the money. But you see, I'm not comfortable you going for that shopping all by yourself. Why? But ever since I came to your house, I've been staying here all alone. Why can't I go out? Why is because that is not safe for you going there all by yourself? But brother, you know that I... It... Michael, listen to me. Listen to me. Even if we're going to go for that shopping, one of the guys will go with you. I prefer to go alone. Hmm? I'm no longer a child. I know that you're no longer a child, but... Mika, I know what I'm telling you. I know here more than you. But I'll be fine. Okay? Have a good day. It's, it's, it's okay. It's okay. Just be careful. Okay. Let's, let's, let's move, let's move it, please. We have to move it, please. Hey! The boy has crossed the borderline. The only way to see him again is to join him in the world beyond. Come on, it's me. And what do you want? Where are you heading to? The last time I checked, it's none of your business. Yeah, you're right. But I don't see any reason why you should be hanging beside the car like I buy it. I'm not a black man. Where's your driver? Well, we, he was supposed to be here. Well, since he's not here, it's your mind. What? Come in. <laughs> oh dear. You know very much well that my brother can not see me with you. You guys are cats and rats, so I, I cannot come inside your car. You know, I was very happy when your brother told me that you were talking about the fight. That you wanted peace. The fight has to stop, but you need to be concerned. And that is why I'm trying to talk to you. So please, can you come in and let's talk? I don't think we, we have anything to talk about. Plus, my brother will not be happy seeing me here with you. That is the problem, Emeka. I just want the fight to end. That's all. So, what do we do? I 
I just want peace to reign. Just let me talk to your brother while I talk to my family. That's it. It's going to be difficult, but I, I, I will try. I will try. Thank you. Yeah. So, should I drop you off? That was what happened. <laughs> My lost spiritual, isn't there something that can be done? Go home and bury the dead. Did you find anything? No, boss. I couldn't lay my hands on anything substantial. Release. Okay, boss. Uh, boss, I, I got her number through a friend of mine who is an internet wizard who also works as an internet provider. Beautiful. Send the number to Chigose immediately. Be fast about it. Yes, boss. Be fast!
Good day, ma'am. Good day. You have to be faster about this. I don't have time. The reason I honor this invitation is because I always know that you are the one seeking for peace all this while. And for the love and respect I have for my late husband, your father. That's why I'm here. Ma, how, uh, how long do we have to spend here? Less than five minutes. My okay. driver is waiting for me at the other side. Okay, since we don't have much time, let me summon the whole thing in one place. Ma, what do we do to restore joy and happiness in our family? What do we do? I am aware that some of us had come earlier to present their offering personally and specially. Tomorrow is the offering of the eleventh month for the year. It is to both commemorate our past brothers and sisters who built on the foundation with which we enjoy today and the culmination of the sacrifices and offering for the year. With this, we will have one more offering to do we will have the assemblage of the full house. One more offering to do for the year. This is a difficult question to answer. I don't know. I don't know. I, I guess uh, 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 the problem was the struggle about dominions. But you and Donine are now wealthy. No one is envious of another anymore. So I keep asking myself. What is still the problem? I must say, two good heads are better than one. So you have to come and talk it out with your sister. Come and talk to her. I will be there to make sure she listens to you. So I think that is your duty as a man. Mama, thank you so much. I really appreciate. I knew that you're one person that I could talk to. Thank you so much.
wrong with you, Onye? What has come over you? You really want to know what has come over me, right? You had the guts to kill my sister. How dare you? Your sister? How? Oh, no, my sister. Oh, now you want to pretend like you don't know what I'm talking about, right? Amara was your sister? No, Rama was my sister. Oh, how was I supposed to know Amara was your sister? Oh, how was I supposed to know? Well, you are going to know by the time I take you to the deepest part of hell. And you listen to me. You will pay daily for it. I swear to God, you will pay with your life. I will make your life so miserable. Please, I am, I am sorry. Oh, please. I am sorry. Get your hand to my side, please. Oh, yeah. The next time I will come back to this house, I will punch you in your eyes. Oh, yeah. oh yeah. I'm sorry. Okay, I'm, I'm sorry. I never meant to. Oh, yeah. Please, I'm sorry. Rosie. So that's all you need to do. You must go through. You bastard! You killed my mother. I am going to snuff life out of you. How dare you? You killed my younger brother. Just to satisfy your taste for his blood. Even when you knew I had no hands in your sister's death. As long as I live, I am going to make you lose every single thing you have. Since I cannot kill you, you are second hand. Both of you must respect my presence. My lord, this carcass from the pit of hell had the cost to kill my mother and I am not going to let you go. I am not going to let her slide. I will snuff life out of you. I swear. Hmm. Enough of that! Why it? Quiet. Try it. Can't take any of me. Now, this is guy at home. Shut up! My lord, please. I am only going to let this. This demented being leave. If only you can bring back my mother's life. Else. Chagosi. Me, Tiko, do you see? Enough. Enough. My lord. I am going to bring back your mother's life into existence. If you only you can bring back his brother's life into existence. The young man whom you sacrificed for nothing. Until then, it is an eye for an eye. A tooth. For a thief. Chikuleke. Lichi. Fokoti. Mangala. Ibu. Listen, you owe her no apology. Absolutely no apology. At least now she knows how it feels to be betrayed. You have no idea what I have done. Sugar is my very close friend. Very close. In fact, I brought her to Lord Raymond myself. I brought her into the family myself. I would never want to do a thing like this to her. Not in my entire life. Well, it has happened. And you and I know that these things cannot be altered. No. Sugar killed the only man that I've ever loved. So I, I think it's only fair for her to, for, for this thing to actually be normal to her too. I will defeat you and I will destroy you 
since you've chosen to be destroyed, what will you have me do? Hey, I'll deal with you. Now that I know you are not You are wasting your time. I know man. Get off my phone! Can I at least say something? What is it? Calm down, okay? Calm down. I'm not a monster. I don't bite. I never said you were. Okay. One more thing. One last thing. Okay. One last thing. Fine. What is it? Uh, the last thing is... Um, okay. I'm Chigoze. You can call me Gozier. Okay, I, I, I just want us to be friends. If you can give me the chance. I don't want to be your friend. Hey. I've told you, I don't want to be your friend. Why? You said that five months ago. That was a long time. I thought you've changed your mind. I haven't changed my mind. I'm still saying it again, Mr. Chigozi, I don't want to be your friend. Not you, nor anybody else. Hey. Um, um, please, as you can see, I'm going to church. I, I know, I can actually drop you Thank off. you, I don't need it. Thank you, stop disturbing uh, 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 me, um, leave um, me alone. Um, um, can, can, I, can, can I take you to church? Can I at least get your number? Can I buy you a rose? Jose, you see, I, I don't really like all these girls that prove too hard to get. How will you be asking a girl out for one month? In a sea, one man of the Kamanya, palliative woman, a big palliative of what, but I say for half an hour, boy. In our one more for one good month, only one cable. Eh? Are you deputy Virgin Mary? I'm banana da kon de ka ka wan ne. Ba o mbu na. You know I met one on my way the other day. And, you know when I was desperately in need of my monthly offering. I wanted to carry her but the girl was just being so hard. You know I thought it was a joke. I told her babe come on. Let me drop you off to wherever you're going to. Want a cleaner of the mind you go. She never cared to look at my face not to talk to me. I thought it was a joke, you know. Then two months after, I met that same girl. But this time around, she managed to talk to me. I thought in the evening I'd go, I'd go, mama, you know. I was about to carry the girl. The girl ignored me and walked out on me. Oh, you? Hmm. She refused. I'm telling you honestly. 
So last last, what is going to happen? Olosho. Olosho? The Olosho I carry do my monthly offering. <laughs> I'm telling you honestly. <laughs> but there's, there's, there's something about that girl, that particular girl. You know, the one if I'm angry and I see that girl, all my anger and souls and everything will just disappear. I think there's something about that girl. You are seriously liking that girl? For real, tell me the truth. But how can I like you? that girl so much? <laughs> but does he, you are crushing on some girl you will never, ever go close to. How, how, how is that possible? We're talking about love here. I got some feelings for her, man. See, I'm smiling. <laughs> Only the thought of her. <laughs> Wait. You are seriously liking this yeah, guy? Yeah, can't you see I'm smiling sheepishly? I'm <laughs> Eh? <laughs> 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 the most important thing that I'm going to have my monthly offering. <laughs> huh? Mm. Is it not? Very, very important. Good. Very, very important. Very important. Oyechi. <laughs> Your continuous agitation in portions of this matter will only amount to one step against the law. I've told you to stop for the last time Stop pursuing this matter. Chia Gozia is your blood brother. Blood brother, my fault. My blood, the same blood brother that took everything away from me. Why is no one seeing it from that perspective? Why? Because you've allowed selfishness to be cloud your sense of wisdom, including those around you. Fine. So what do you have me do? Leave and let leave. Never. Hi. How are you? How do you know where I live? No, I don't even know you live here. I'm actually waiting for someone. You lie. Liar. No, I, I am not lying. Okay, the truth is that I followed you up the other day. What do you want? Um, I, I don't even know your name. My name is Nkechinye. Can I at least get your number, please? my number then you have to follow me to church church yes church oh fine you're not ready oh, oh, oh okay 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 i will oh i will follow you to church it's okay i agree and then i get your number and everything right you get in here right yes you can call me was Okay, can I drop you off? You see, God's word, speaking in 2 Corinthians chapter 5 and verse 7, says that we walk by faith and not by sight. And if you read backwards to chapter 4 and verse 18, 
It says that the things that are seen are temporal, but the things that are not seen, they are permanent, even the eternal word of God. So, um, I would not want you to be deceived by the things you see, but rather, pray. Pray endlessly. Pastor, I see him as someone who is in the midst of something stronger than him. And that same thing might end up destroying him if he doesn't get the help he needs. Pastor, maybe that's why God brought him my way. Maybe. Um, yeah. You see, I believe in your spirit of discernment. Because God is a God of time and purpose. And I also believe that he brings people our way for a reason. But you must pray earnestly. Pray, because the Bible says that the fervent and earnest prayer of a righteous man make a tremendous power available and work in wonders. So I'd want you to pray very seriously. And in fact, I will join you in this prayer. Thank you so much, Pastor. Thank you. Thank you, Pastor. I'm grateful. You're welcome. You're welcome. Um, Father, in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. You say that if two shall agree as touching one thing, it shall be done for them on the face of the earth. Lord, we join our spirit and our faith together to agree that the spirit of revelation and clarity in revelation is given now. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ, Amen. you have the spirit of clarity. You have clarity in vision. Amen. You have clarity in revelation. Amen. You will see and you will understand. Amen. The things that are hidden from the eyes of the normal man are revealed to the sons of God. Receive that revelation. Amen. Receive that clarity. Amen. In the name of Jesus Amen. Christ, you shall not walk in confusion. Amen. You shall not walk in confusion. Amen. You have stability in vision. Amen. For God reveals to redeem him. Let God, through his spirit, give you revelations of the things you cannot understand by man, but you will understand through the spirit. Let it be so in Jesus' mighty name. Very, very tired. Woo. What is it? Why are you staring at me like that? You don't know how much I cherish you. But unfortunately, you still see me like a stranger. Stranger? Yeah. I, I don't understand. How do you mean? It's okay. Come on. Let's go. Go where? Where are we going to? I can actually drop you off at your place. Okay. Fine. Sorry. But no more jogging, I'm tired. <laughs> you have to jog. What a pleasant surprise. I never expected you at all. <laughs> well, I... I knew you were going to be surprised to see me. Yes. Surprised? 
I am more than surprised. I must say, your house is very beautiful. It's fine. <laughs> you can say that again. Uh, it's okay. What else do I offer you? I have champagne, I have red wine, cake. Yeah. Um, don't worry, what I will do, I'll work it. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm okay, very okay with water. Are you sure? I'm very, very okay. What the heck? I'm so happy you're here. I'm not going to do it. Hmm? Which kind of woman being come be that one? Now? How can she go as far as rejecting gifts? Which kind of form him come be that one? She's not for me. She's just principal. Which kind of principal be that one? Which kind of principal be that one? Eh? She get money. On will let go. Boy, she has Christ in her. Oh. She's even a born again Christian. But what are you doing with a born again Christian? Give me a whole lot of corner. She's the best I've ever met in my life. Kechiyer is her name. She has a nice name. I think I would like to meet her. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Don't even go there. I will never allow you to meet her. You that is looking for who to use for offering. <laughs> huh? Boy, you know I can't do something like that. Hmm? But you and I know last, last, we still use that. Over my dead body. You seriously like this girl? Very serious. So that is what the word of God says about marriage and sex. So you know, since that is what the world says, we're supposed to obey it. We have to. Uh, yes, uh, no, I am not. I mean, I'm not afraid or ashamed to say it. Long before I knew what the word of God says, I. I wasn't doing it, but now that I know, I promise God that I'm going to keep to my promises till our honeymoon. Like you a lot. Yeah. Really? How come? <laughs> How? Apart from the fact that you're so beautiful, you're also principled. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. mm, yes. But principled. No, I'm not sure. I'm not too sure that I am. Mm -mm. Why, 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 why do you think so? I think I'm that principal. No, no, I don't think so. But I'm just obedient to God's word. That's all. Are you now saying that um, <laughs> that we're not going to 
have sex? Of course, yes. To get married? Yes. We are not going to have sex. We are not going to have sex. Just wait. She goes, you mean you want to have sex with me? Like, you, you, you uh, uh, want uh, to uh, have sex uh, with uh, me? Of course, no, no. This is all about sex. Mm -mm, mm -mm. I, I, come on, I'm not a vampire. I, see, I, I, I like you a lot. And I'm ready to go any length to prove it to you. Oh, come on, your, your drink. Mm -mm. It's, it's not alcohol. You like it. It's just a sweet wine. I, I know, thank mm. you. Mm. I'm okay, I'm, I'm very fine. Are you sure? Yes, I'm fine, thank you. Are you cold? It is time for your monthly presentation. Sit down. Finally, the chick has come to the rooster with the mother hen. Chia Goze has not only broken the law, but he has waged war on us. Killing one of us for a ransom is totally outside the cycle. But it is out of ignorance that makes the rat to challenge the cat for a fight. As the Grand Master of this great confraternity, and as the father of this lovely family, I summon his soul here. My lord. Do you know how stubborn and persistent Chabuzi can be when he has to do with a church girl? Although I don't even see what it sees in her, but I think the best thing for us to do is to kill him. Please, my lord. I have not asked for your opinion, Onye. My Lord Spiritual. You are the one who introduced him to this great confraternity. I am giving him only three days to reconsider his impudent adventure. Three days. Thank you, my Lord Spiritual. What he's asking of me is very impossible. And over my dead body will I do it. Chikose. Chikose, do you remember how erratic you felt when your younger brother disobeyed you and died? Do you? That's exactly how I'm feeling right now. Fires, I do not care. There is difference. My brother died. But I am not going to die. That is the difference. What must I give you three days? Three good days. When it lapses, who do you think he would come for? There is no way I'm giving up. My girl. Chico, see, Chico, see, Chico, 
Uzi, what is wrong with you? You asked for money. How much is money? You bring it go. Eh? Why not do this little sacrifice? What is wrong with you? Yes. What is wrong with you? It's not about money. Love. Love. Love is involved. Sammy. Uh, of course, I didn't know anything. I, 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 I didn't know anything about that. What are you saying? You didn't know anything about what? I was actually going to church and they kidnapped me. I never called anyone or told anyone where I was. How come you knew where I was? How? Gossie, if you're not going to say anything, I'm going to leave this car right now. Stop this car, let me leave. Just tell me the truth. Okay, okay, okay. I am going to tell you the truth, okay? I'm going to tell you, just calm down, just calm down.
I belonged to one gang like that. And I was the head kidnapper. But I decided to leave them. Then our boss made up his mind that he must kill me. So they kidnapped you just to get at me. But one of us, he was supposed to execute. But I saved the guy. So he was the only person I was still connecting with. So he showed me a picture of a young, beautiful lady. And that beautiful lady happens to be you that they kidnapped. So I decided to come for you. I'm sorry I didn't tell you about all this. Uh, it's okay, it's fine. I just wanted to hear the truth. It's okay. Let's go. Where do we go from here? Because your house is not safe for now, neither mine. Okay, fine. Take me to my pastor's house. I, I think I'll be safe there. Please. I cannot go through that road that you want me to take because they have their eyes on us. Hmm. They are watching us. They are looking for us. Okay, I know what to do. I am going to... I am going to take through the other road. Okay, fine. Anything, anything, please. I'm sorry, I'm sorry about that. I'm sorry I didn't let you know what, what I was doing. It's fine, it's okay. I just know that I'm scared, I'm just scared. You'll be fine, okay? You'll be fine. told me that you are going to talk with that numbskull. My Lord Spiritual, what is going on? That idiot, that stupid girl and her church members are covering him with so much powers. They have moved him away to another roof, far away from the boys. My lord, Sugar was right when she said you should kill that young man. Shut now this is it. Shut up. It's not a hard nut to crack. It's not considered a bomb on the road. Sister Nkechina here told me about you. And in my place of prayer, the spirit of the living God ministered to me and told me everything that happened today. As a matter of fact, he also told me that you 
a servant under the master of darkness. And this master of darkness is after both of your lives because you, you refused to offer her as requested as the last sacrifice of the year. This, this is because you genuinely love her. Is this true? Pastor, you're right. Thank you, Holy Spirit of God. Jesus. Wait. You mean you lied to me? No, it, it, it's you... okay. It's okay, sister. Weep not is the verdict of redemption. God is still in control. Do not worry. The Bible says that every tree that is not planted of my father shall be uprooted. Therefore, we will need to pray to disconnect you from every ties you have to that temple. Is that okay? You lie! You lie! Whoever you are and whatever you are saying is a lie! Who is he that speaks and it comes to pass when the Lord has not spoken? Be in the mood of prayer. Pray. Pray. Be in the spirit. Listen! The earth is the Lord's and the fullness thereof. The man and all that dwell therein. Pray with me, pray with me. Can two work together except they be in agreement? Pray. For when we pray in the spirit, our spirit prays. Our mind is unfruitful, but in the spirit we speak mysteries. Shatu parika supara daga daga ya nabaha Liba baba ba shata laba daga baha Yay for this cause can the son of man that he would destroy Oh the works of the devil Badom bere suka padi ya nabaha Ode Hear the voice of the spirit I see a ring He that will be delivered from the devil Should relinquish every property that belongs to the devil the ring on your finger belongs to the devil. Release it. By the fire of the Holy Ghost. Lose it now. Lose it now. Our God is plotted in fire. I release the fire of God. Now in the name of Jesus. 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 Oh, for this is the victory that overcomes the world, even our faith. Give him glory. Give him glory. Give him glory. Sharabata barada kabatosi atalabaha. Sososeri kabaturi atalabaha. In the name of Jesus. Listen to me. Listen to me. The Bible says that these are people that are ensnared in a hole and they are robbed. And there is nobody that cry yet restore. But here is a man, a voice of God, saying, Restore. I therefore decree, Restore in the name of Jesus. Restore in the name of Jesus. Restore in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Give him glory. Give him glory. Give him glory. In Jesus, mighty name, we pray. And amen. Hallelujah. The ring. God has taken over. You see, the Bible says that if any man is in Christ Jesus, he is a new creation. Old things have passed away. Behold, all things have become new. Um, Mr. Chiaguzi. Mr. 
Now that you have confessed Jesus, you are saved. There is one more thing. You will have to give up everything. Everything they gave to you. Pastor, I'm ready to do anything. I am for Christ now. Hallelujah! Amen. Praise God forevermore. You know, your decision is the best decision any human on the face of the earth can ever make, accepting Jesus. Glory to God. Yeah. <laughs> so you see all those like big, big houses and those flashy cars. I, I, I do not want them anymore. What do I do with them? You need not to worry. The spirit of the living God to tell us what to do. Okay? Um, but there is one more thing. Um, Brother Chibiki, <clears throat> let me read a portion of the scripture for you. John chapter 1 and verse 14. And Christ became a human being and lived here on earth amongst us and was full of loving forgiveness and truth. And some of us have seen his glory, the glory of the only Son of the Heavenly Father. Key word, loving forgiveness. I sent for you because I, I, I know I need to talk to you. Right now, even your body language and your countenance tells me that there is a big war going on in your spirit. But I want to remind you that the Bible says that if any man be in Christ, he's a new creation. Old things are passed away. Behold, all things have become new. The man that made the confession yesterday before the witness of the church is a new man. The man that did the things he testified about is dead. He has brought us out of darkness into the light of his dear son. So I called you here to plead with you to satisfy the principles of scripture, Jesus says, how many times will a brother sin against you before you condemn or judge him? He said 70 times 7, 490 times. Remember, we must forgive those that have sinned against us so that the Heavenly Father will forgive us. I plead with you to let go, release your heart, forgive brother Chiguzi. He's a new man, your brother in Christ now. Please. Pastor, Pastor, I'm sorry. Pastor, you've known me for three and a half years that I've been worshiping in this church. Yes, that's true. Have you ever heard that for once I exchanged words with anybody? Or that I fought? Or have I ever said no to anything that has to do with this kingdom? No. No. Pastor, I am sorry I am going to disappoint you on this. Pastor, do you also remember the day I ran into this place and told you that my sister has been missing for three days? That my sister has been missing for three days? Pastor, we prayed, we fasted, not even her dead body. And all of a sudden, someone came out from nowhere to my own before he confessed that he killed my only sister, Pastor. This is too hard for me to bear. Uh, uh, Brother Chibike, if I say that it's not worthy of the expression of your anger, then I lie. We have flesh, but remember, Jesus says, be angry 
and sin not. On another place, he said, do not let the sun go down on your anger. We are dealing with a sanctified, recreated and renewed child of God for whom Jesus was sacrificed on the cross of Calvary for. He's a new creation. If God can forgive him and set him on a path of peace and newness, who are we? Who are we? Forgive him. Pastor, please. I'm sorry. Pastor, I can't let this go. You can. I cannot let this go. That man will suffer for this. Judgment belongs to God. Pastor, I still remember what the scripture says. But this is my blood sister we're talking about. I'm the only one left in this life. Your blood sister, but also a child of God. Remember Paul. Paul in Acts chapter 9 was on his way to kill the brethren when God intercepted and saved him and used him. It's not about what we have done. It's about what God can do with us. It's, a, it's not about where we came from, but where God is taking us to. Remember, Brother Chibike, we were all sinners, yet Christ died for us. You know, I have told my story. I was not always saved. Please let go. Pastor, please, I'm sorry. Brother Chibike. Pastor, I am sorry. Please, I can't, I can't bear this. Pastor, please, I'm sorry. Don't let the Spirit of God, Brother Chibike. Brother Chibike. He that began the good work in your life, he will bring it to a perfect conclusion. Amen. Right? What he has started to do, he will not stop. Amen. Right? Amen. Everything Amen. is all right. Upside. This is the motto. Yes. Okay. So we'll we'll have have For Madrakis. Uh, 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 wait, wait. wait. Killed my sister. does not check the amount of sin you've committed. God does not care about your sin. He cares about your heart. How remorseful you are. It's only God that can cleanse your sin if you're ready to give up and repent with all your heart. He is ready to cleanse your sin. He is the omnipotent, omniscience, omnipresence. He is the Almighty God. He is ready to forgive us. But just make up your mind to give up. Let us pray. Mama de Rigia Kanaboria. Mama de Rigi on your mind. Mama de Rigo do Guacataca. Mama de Rigi on your man. Mama de Rigo is on our boy. I'm for you. I'm putting for you. Mama de Mama de Rigi. Mama de Amaraya Vara Muba. Amaraya Amara Jesus Baramova, Ngeji Ajayu. Vanity upon vanity. Ah, oh, yeah. ah, it is vanity upon vanity. Trouble and lots of predicaments. The gift of the devil. It can never give you the peace of mind. Oh, 
You know, there is nothing the Lord cannot do. As we echo in the kingdom here, what God cannot do does not exist. Hallelujah. <laughs> you know, the Bible says a thousand years is like a day in the sight of our good God. I just could not believe it when she said to me that God told her in a vision to wait for you. I mean, putting your life on hold for a whole seven years waiting for a man, it took me a year before I could believe it. <laughs> but you know the ways of God. The ways of God are not the ways of man. They are past finding. Glory to Jesus. I'm happy. My dear, you are right. God's ways are... It's very, I mean, it's past finding. It's very mysterious. Who could have believed on earth that's me, Oliyechi? That I can accept the true love that Christ has for me. That I would accept Christ into my life. Who could have believed it? Thank you, Jesus. Uh, how did you two get to how did you get to know each other? How much did he preach to you? Well, he didn't really preach so long. You know, we were in the same court together. And then um, starting from the whole thing that was happening, the death of my mother, my sister, you know, my brother, so many things. And then one day he walked up to me and started preaching to me. I was surprised. I was shocked. He told me how you've done everything possible to make him accept Christ. The fact that I was still in jail, it was our fourth year in jail. He walked up to me and he told me about Christ. I loved every bit of that preaching. Who could have believed that you would have waited for him? And in a month's time, you guys are getting married. You see, this life is full of misery. I am so happy for both of you. And that's all I can see for now. I am so, so happy. Congratulations in advance. Thank you. And I'm glad you accepted Christ. I'm glad you're safe. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. You got it. Okay. So fire bone. Fire bone. So fire bone. Man, uh, so fireball, 